going on everyone? Good afternoon. It's actually a Saturday here in Vancouver. I'm actually in Richmond right now. I can't believe I've lived here for so long and I've never been to the Richmond uh, public market. Uh, thank you for everyone that recommended me some great eats on my Instagram. Uh, it's actually my first time here, so I'm pretty, pretty excited. I'm curious what's inside, what kind of food they have. Uh, so let's go check it out. It's lunchtime right now here, so it's really, really busy. Everything's open. Uh, this market actually opens at 9 a.m., so bright, nice and early, actually. Uh, I'm just strolling around, looking for everyone's recommendation on Instagram. Uh, yeah, check it out. The first food court I've been to that I actually seen crab, salt and pepper crab at a food court, Chinese food court. How awesome is that? But just look at all the food. It just looks so clean and delicious. Oh my God, check out this chicken. Look how beautiful that chicken looks. Amazing. Jesus, where have this food court been all my life? Look at how beautiful. It just looks beautiful, not like other food courts. Check out the egg. Like I've been to a lot of food courts, especially Chinese food courts, and they don't look this clean. So on the cleanless level, this place is lit. More crabs, salt and pepper crabs, a lot of crabs, a lot of fried shrimp, calamari. Oh my God, look at all that fish. In front of uh, Xi and Cuisine right now, uh, a recommendation which is uh, my French chef. He told me it's um, mountain Chinese food. I don't even know what to order to be honest. I've never had mountain Chinese food before, but uh, let's find out. This is northern uh, Chinese cuisine. Uh, all the noodles are fresh and made to order right there as you can see. That dough, it's all fresh noodles and every single noodle dish they have is freshly made. Uh, and another thing he tells me is this is some must-gets. The Chinese pork bun and uh, pancake rice with beef. Or you can go for some spicy wonton. Somebody's order and honestly, I was gonna go for the pancakes, but I think I'm gonna go for the pancake beef roll instead because that looks so crispy. Uh, hey boss, uh, which noodle soup should I get? What's your f most famous one here? Yeah, number one. Number lamb one? Noodle. Yeah. Uh, number one, what, what noodle? Lamb noodle. Lamb noodle. Yeah. Okay, can I get one number one? Okay. And can I get uh, the pancake roll pancake with beef? beef. Okay. That's the one uh, the lady had, right? Yeah, can I get one of those? God, here is my meal. How good does this look? Beef rice, rice roll. Look how thick and crispy that is. And it's like burnt, like charred. And we got their number one, which is their special, which is what they're famous for, the stall. But look at this. Oh my God, this is huge. And it's just stuffed with beef and scallions. I've never seen rice roll like this for $12, okay? I thought that was a bit expensive when I ordered it, but when it came out, I am not complaining, man. This is definitely worth $12. You see that? Charred, crispy, beefy, and you see all that onion? Let's dip it with some chili oil, okay? You can get the chili oil when you pick up your order. It's on the left side, $12. It just, this looks, this looks so good. Mmm. Oh my god. Nice and crispy and a little burnt but not over burnt, okay? On the outside. Nice hot beef on the inside. Love the sauce by the way. I wish there was more sauce though. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Wish there was more sauce on the inside. Beautiful. Mm. Wow. Actually, when you get in on your second bite, more sauce comes out. It's all the way in there. See that? Look at this nice, juicy bite. Look at all that sauce, bro. Mm. On this inside right here with the sauce, it's nice and soft. You only get that crispy and hard on the outside. I thought it was too burnt, but trust me, this is not too burnt. It's perfect. You know what? Let's try this. I'm gonna dip it with my lamb soup. This is crazy. Who does that? I do. Here you go. Mmm. Oh, that lamb soup. 
that's so nice and mild. Dipping this with this, to be honest, it just softens everything up. It's like a little sponge. Sponge of goodness. I'm gonna get all that soup in here. Mmm. Guys, if you wanna get this, please dip it. Trust me, it's a good idea. Up next, we got their special, which is what they're known for, Northern Chinese cuisine, um, fresh made uh, noodles. I saw it right on the spot when he was there. It's like, chop, 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 chop. And I took it to the back and he boiled it. Sorry, I'm at a really, really small table right now. It's lunchtime and there's just no seating. So I don't have to bend a bit, okay? Look at that. Nice, cold noodles. Look at that. Look at that. Nice, long strains of noodles. Got big chunks of lamb in here okay lots of veggies lots of veggies a lot of green veggies scallions okay let's see what these fresh made noodles are about wow. they're so soft it just falls apart oh my god these noodles are so good oh my god If you don't slurp your noodles, you're doing it wrong, bro. You gotta slurp your noodle. It's an Asian thing. Like in Japan, people slurp their noodles all the time. And you get looked at weird if you don't do it. So do it. Oh my God, these noodles are to die for. And that lamb. You know lamb? When you don't clean it right or cook it right, there's an after smell, but no man, this, this soup is amazing. Look at how light that broth is. Wow, that soup is magical. It's just so clean. I don't taste any sugar, salt, nothing in there. It's just, it's done right. Oh my God, the soup is fire, bro. Oh my God. I am. Mm, mm, I forgot. Gotta add chili oil in it. Chili oil, we eat Chinese food or even noodles, and you gotta put some chili oil. You gotta kick it up a notch. It's not right, trust me. This chili oil is gonna make this bowl of soup like next, next level. Look at that, look at that. Nice and red now. Okay, gotta get, oh my God. And there's, they're generous with the noodles here. It's a big portion for $14. Like, and it's fresh. Look at all that. Here, let me show you how much noodle there is. Look at, look at that. Look at that noodle. You'll we'll never get this anywhere else. Okay. Mmm. Wow. That chili oil just made everything so much better. Everything just comes together. Mmm. Oh my God, these noodles. Look at that. Look at that. Let's talk about these chunks of lamb though. They don't deep out too. There's quite a bit of lamb in here. Nice bite-sized lamb. Mmm, that's the lean part. I actually got a lot of lean part. I don't really got much fat in here. I'm not complaining, man. I like lean. Wow, look at, well, only if you can see how much noodles and lamb there is in here. Ah, oh, I'm a happy man. Chef B, you're right. Good recommendation, bro. Good, good recommendation. Okay, let's get some noodles. Let's get some lamb and some broth. And that's how you're supposed to do it. This spoon is so small. I'm gonna put the noodles in my mouth first, okay? Absolutely amazing. Love it. Northern Chinese food. I'll find you guys. I'm gonna do a whole episode of Northern Chinese food at some restaurant here in Vancouver. Mark my word on it. Yo, 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 yo. Look at this beef and rice roll. Yo, this is a must get. Okay, dip it. We're gonna dip it again. We're gonna dip it again, okay? We're gonna dip it again. Mmm. Even after you dip it, you still get that crispiness, but a nice, like that, the, the the dough just acts like a sponge, so you get crispy, soupy, scallion, the sauce on the inside, the nice beef texture. Oh my God. All day, every day, baby. 
Mm. Yum, the soup, man, is still the star. Such a great, beautiful soup. Love I it. I cannot decide uh, what to get. Chef Chinese Cuisine or Captain Wa. They both look so good. They're pre-made food. But here's the thing, okay? One side, which is Tony's Chinese Cuisine, uh, three item combo is $13. But if you go over here on the right, you can get the exact same thing, three items for $12. So that's $1 of savings. So you make the pick. I think I'm gonna go for the cheaper side over here. I kind of know what I want already. Uh, the food here looks really, really good. Uh, hi, can I get your three piece? Three piece? No, no, three item. Yeah. Uh, can I get it with uh, rice, please? This curry looks really good, to be honest. I've seen curry before at other places. Can I get it with curry? Uh, chicken curry? Uh, yes, can you put the sauce? Yeah, right there is good. The two, not too much. Uh, can I get some, uh, is that fish? Yes, can I get some, what kind of fish is that? Okay, can I get some fish? Okay, one more topping. Tofu good? Can I get some tofu? Awesome. Thank you so much. Okay, yeah, this one is very good. Okay, oh, what? This one is very good? Very good. What is that, what no, is that one? No pork. Sweet and sour pork. No Sweet pork. and sour pork. Yeah. Thank you so much. Honey oh, honey garlic, garlic too. You're giving me so much stuff. Uh, oh my God. <laughs> okay. Anything, try it, okay? Thank you so much for the hospitality. Honey garlic chicken, okay? Okay, honey garlic chicken. Oh my God. She's so honey. nice. Oh my God. <laughs> More broccoli. Thank you, thank you, Auntie. God, guys, you guys see everything she gave me on the house? This is a heavy, heavy, big, big box. We got uh, some spare ribs in there. We got chicken, we got tofu, we got some broccoli. Uh, oh my God, where do I even begin? Okay, I'm not even gonna open this container yet. Let's talk about the outside first. This thing is heavy. This thing's at least three, four pounds. I'm not kidding you, man. And I can do some like shoulder press on this. I can do some, you know, like curls. It's that heavy. This food, like she gave me so much extra, it, it's crazy. Thank you for the hospitality. Uh, the auntie there was so nice at Captain Wa. Uh, she gave me, so God, I didn't know where to start. Okay, let's just get into it. And there's no possible way I'm gonna finish this. I'm gonna bring it home to my parents or something. Okay. Let's start out with some broccoli. Mmm. The broccoli is cooked good. Okay. Sweet and sour pork. Mm, look at that, nice. Sauce on the outside. Look at that. Mm. Even better on the inside. My rice is drained with sauce right now. Curry sauce and some other sauce from the fish. Look at that nice yellow. Mmm. Mmm. That curry is good. I love curry, by the way. Hey, but if you guys are enjoying this content so far, make sure you drop a comment down below and subscribe now while you're at it. Okay. Spare ribs. This is, what, what kind of ribs are these? Oh my God, they're huge. Mmm. Honey garlic spare ribs. My ribs, I love chewing on this cartilage right here, the bone. But honestly, this bone is way too big, so I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna eat around it. Then some vegetables. Nice green vegetables, lettuce. Mm. Oh, you got lettuce with bean sprout, okay? The bean sprout gives it a nice crunch. Love the sauce that they do. And, mm, mm. Okay, the fish. This is a lot of fish, oh my god. How much, $12 for all this for three items? This is crazy, like, bro, this is not even a deal, it's a steal. Like, oh my god, how much, or maybe I'm, nice piece of fish. Mm. Wow, look at that. Honestly, this is probably one of the best 
Chinese Asian food court I've been to. So much varieties here. Okay, we got another humongous spare ribs that is freaking huge. I don't know what this is though. Mmm. Mmm. No bone or cartilage. Nice top. Would have been crispier if all the sauce didn't soak on it. Mmm. Mm. A nice piece of bone. This one is chewable. I'm gonna do that. Mmm. Yeah. Nice size, bite sized tofu. Mmm. Just a regular tofu. Dried mushroom. That's with the tofu, by the way. Mmm. Okay, gonna get some vegetables with some rice. Right. right. What haven't I tried yet? There's so much stuff in there, I don't even know where to start from. Oh! The curry chicken. Okay. Let's get into one of these potatoes. A nice a yellow potato. Cook this off. Mm hmm Yeah! Who doesn't love potatoes? I use the air fryer man. She's got some rice and beef sprout. Mm -hmm. The curry chicken. Let's go. This is honestly for twelve dollars for all this. I'm not kidding you. There's no complaints. Like for that price, for this kind of quality, it's it's good. I'm not kidding you. Okay. Like, you do not know how heavy and how big this is. For $12, I'm not kidding, you can bring this to work and eat it for the next three days. I, and I'm not even exaggerating right now. It, it's crazy. This is probably, oh God, like, yeah, it's huge. Steel, it's a deal. You must come to Captain Wa and try some of the food. And they have crabs there too, by the way. So you can get that. Okay. Let's keep on moving. You know what? I'm gonna try one more spot. Uh, a girl on my Instagram uh, message and said, uh, it's called Peanuts. They have, it's very, very affordable. I was looking at the prices and it's like four or $5. You can get a bubble tea. Uh, I think it's a waffle wheel. To show you the lineup of Peanuts, how busy it is. And I've walked by here many times uh, today and it's always a lineup. This is crazy. I'm looking at the menu and it's so affordable. That girl was so right on my Instagram. Uh, you got drinks from starting at $3.50. What drink can you get for $3.50 here in Vancouver? Nothing. And it goes up to about $5. You got $3.50, $4, $5. A lot of bubble waffle and dessert uh, varieties. But you know what? I don't think I'm gonna get a bubble waffle. I'm too full. So I'm gonna get myself a slush, something refreshing, uh, but I don't know what kind of slush yet. So we'll see when we get up there. Got myself a fresh mango drink, which was uh, five fifty. Uh, remember, all these drinks they don't come with topping, so it depends on what kind of topping you want. It starts off uh, with fifty cents up to one seventy five. So I got, and if you want to make it a slushy, it's an extra fifty cents. Mmm, so good this watermelon slushy. After all that greasy food, it hits the spot. Guys, if you guys like contents like this, make sure you subscribe now. If you haven't clicked that like and that notification bell, make sure you do it now. What are you waiting for? All right, until next time, see you. Peace.